And Southern Arkansas is in the building. Yes, we are. <laughs> there is really a horse in the studio. This is happening. And that is the most well-behaved mule. I'm sorry. Mule. Because you guys yeah, do are. Do not offend her. Yes. That sorry. is a mule. Sorry. In my broadcasting career, I can honestly tell you I, I never truly expected this, but here we are. You okay? <laughs> you all right, Molly? All right. So, this all started as a goof because we were talking one day. I don't know if, I, I don't know if you guys know the whole story, but there is a tight end yes. that played at Southern Arkansas yes. who was one of the leaders in the preseason uh, for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, and I mentioned – that he had gone to Southern Arkansas. Mm -hmm. This spurned on the conversation. I've never even heard of Southern Arkansas. Well, it was he was originally at Memphis and transferred to Southern Arkansas. Right. Yeah. He came to Memphis as a quarterback and then transferred to Southern Arkansas, played tight end, and now has um, – and, and was having a great preseason. And I said, what is their mascot? And Roser said, the Mule Riders. We then posted the clip of which somehow you saw. Yes, one of my friends tagged me in it. So that's how I saw it. One of your friends tagged you in it. On Twitter, yes. That the Southern, uh, uh, we, we thought, how awesome is it that they are the Southern Arkansas Mule Riders. Abby, you reached out and you said, I'm the mascot. Mm -hmm. And I can bring... The mule. The mule to the studio. Now... You, you seem so nervous. You just keep looking over <laughs> like, well, what's she going to do? Is she going to do anything here? <laughs> Is she going to do anything she here? She is very well behaved. She is extremely well behaved. She's beautiful, too. All right. How did this happen in terms of you becoming the mascot at I Southern Arkansas? And by the way, let's start from the very beginning. Okay. Where is Southern Arkansas? It's in Magnolia, Arkansas. Magnolia, yes, Arkansas. Yes, Magnolia, Arkansas. So. How long did it take you guys to get here? Four, four hours, four and a half hours. Traffic oh. wasn't bad. So oh, that's not that bad. We left at 730. You left at 7.30? 7.30. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. So you left at 7.30. Magnolia, Arkansas. How did you end up at Southern Arkansas? Uh, I actually toured. It was my senior year of high school, and I actually wasn't going to go to SAU. I was going to go to Louisiana school because that's where I'm, I'm originally from. Okay. And I toured in February, so right before I graduated in May, and I fell in love with it. I'm an ag business major. Okay. love the agriculture program, and that's how I ended up there. So is that what it's known for? Uh, basically, yes, sir. Um, yes. Their engineering program's growing, their nursing program's growing, but agriculture's like what they're based on. Okay, so. and so where else did it, when you visited there, mm -hmm. you liked the ag program? Oh, I loved it. Uh, the girl here, actually, Callie Moyer, gave me my tour. Oh, really? So, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so she gives you the tour. Now, at what point are you thinking, <laughs> they're the mule riders, I know how to ride a mule. Well, actually, Ma ne never No, ride. that's not how that happened. <laughs> Wait, you had never ridden a mule before? No, never. Never. Just horses, not a mule. <laughs> you all right, Molly Ann? That's cool. All right, I'm just making sure. She's kind of looking at... No, my favorite part is because you are not sitting how you normally are. <laughs> you're, you're leaning the other way. <laughs> I don't know what's over there. She ain't going to bite you. Have you ever done an interview with a horse a foot from your face, my I man? I interview horses all the time. <laughs> no. All right, so you had never ridden a mule before in your life. Mm -mm. Did, you didn't grow up around mules? Mm -mm. No. no. Did sorry. you have a dog? Did you have like I had, yeah, animals? I had, I had okay. horses and pigs. I showed horses forever. Since oh, you I was did? Eight, but oh, so you were yeah, yeah, yeah. used just to a mule. being around them. Mm -hmm. yeah. What's the difference between a mule and a horse? They just, they're half donkey and they're stubborn. Oh. Pretty much. Is that right? That's right. But this is how... So kind of like, kind of like us. How does he... Kind of like us. How does he half get... Don half does, ass and stubborn. How is it half donkey and it's this size? Because she has horse in her. Yeah, I know. But I guess that's the dominant gene. Do they usually... That's when you true. responded that it weighs a thousand pounds, <laughs> I, almost, I tried my phone. I thought, I, thought, I thought mules, I guess I just don't know and, about and, mule life. And I, I, I thought and, mules and I, were smaller. Yeah, and I did look it up. Sorry, my and, and I did say. You look I, great. I, I, the thousand pounds, you, you don't look a, a, a oh, pound very over 800. <laughs> It, I looked it up and it, and it says like how big do mules get and the biggest is a thousand pounds yeah. like so they got the biggest mule they can the find the biggest mule in here okay so <laughs> here's the thing biggest mule in the building yeah when you go to Southern Arkansas I need to know how you go from I'm enrolling in Southern Arkansas <laughs> I like the ag program to hey I could be the mascot so this was never your intent when you uh, were going to go to school there I had an idea. Uh, so how, how it works is it's a freshman starting their spring semester, 
and they do it their sophomore year, junior year, and their senior year. So they don't get picked every year. It's like every three years. Uh. And it was coming around my time. So the girl graduating in May was leaving. She finished nursing school, and then it was my turn. Like, applications will go out in January. And so I just applied online. Some of my friends, my family, they were like, do it. Like, it's right up your alley. You'd love it. You know, PR, et cetera. And I was like, okay. And so I applied. And you fill out an application. You have to go to the barn to show that you've actually, like, handled a horse before. Saddler, then you have to meet with, I think I met twice. I met with uh, Coach Rusty once, you know, just face-to-face. And then I met with, like, a panel of people that were from different departments from the school. And then I had to ride her in front of all of them. I was nervous. And then I had to ride her in front of him with the SAU flag. So it, this is, like, a legit, yeah. It's a gig. It's like a gig. Okay, so what all does it entail? What do you have to do? Um, I go to every home football game. Okay. So every time they score a touchdown, uh, up and down the end zone. Um, I've been to parades. Wait, what do you mean up and down the end zone? Does it run? Yeah, she runs with the flag. I have a flag holder right here somewhere. So you pull out the flag and and she runs across the end zone? Yes. Do they score a lot? Yeah. Oh, gosh. Yeah. So you're just running up and down the side. <laughs> of course they score a lot. No, I mean, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> That's why yeah. Molly Ann's in great shape. Yes. It's a lot of exercise. Does she run for field goals or just touchdowns? Both. Both. Mm-hmm. Feel any score. She's running. Yes, she's running until she gets tired. But we'll just keep going. We just keep going. Okay, and it's just end zone to end zone? Mm-hmm. Wait, wait, wait. Do you do the long way or short no, way? Short across way. the end zone? The long, yeah. She just across does the a sprint. Zone. Okay. She does a sprint across, and you've got the flag. Mm-hmm. All right, so every home uh, football game, mm-hmm. that's one of the gigs. That's one of the what gigs. What else? Uh, parades. I've been to a lot of parades. The craziest thing I've ever done besides this is a Mardi Gras parade in Louisiana. Yeah. And she did okay? Yeah, she did. She did okay. Were they throwing beads at yes, her? Yes, beads at me, and I was throwing beads back. <laughs> they're throwing beads at the mule? Yeah, there's still beads in the horse trailer. What? It was wild. Oh, okay. That sounds wild. Okay, so Mardi Gras, you have done. You have to do appearances because you said part of your job is like PR. Yeah. Yes, sir. So they take like we'll do like photo shoots and stuff, and there'll be pictures of me on like little pamphlets they pass out. They mail to students. There's a few billboards of me like uh, in my hometown. There's a few in Arkansas. Um, so yeah, and we do preview days, which is where like uh, potential new students come on campus. And I'll be out there taking pictures with Molly. I brought her um, in actually one of the buildings at SAU. I convinced a guy to let me bring her in like the main building on campus. Um, so we brought her into a freshman orientation program. She's been at the Verizon Arena in Little Rock where they have concerts. She's been at a news station in Magnolia, around Magnolia area. When did you feel as if you and, and Molly Ann really hit it off? Uh, <laughs> we definitely bonded after the Mardi Gras parade. Is that right? <laughs> it was like a four mile parade. It, it was and it was cold, but we stuck it out together. We did. Okay. Now, in terms of where where is she during the day when she's not having to do, you know, <laughs> mule right? stuff. yeah, when she's not doing mule stuff, what is uh, she doing the rest of the day? She has her own little pasture over by the Story Arena, uh, by the Rodeo Arena, and just eats grass. And then she's kept up, you know, for football and stuff. So she'll look nice because we have a game September 14th. How fast can she run? Pretty fast. We don't know. I'm like miles per hour. I haven't right like there. clocked it like a racehorse, but pretty fast. But, but it's pretty fast. Yes. Pretty Has fast. she ever thrown you off? Mm, I think she's tried a few times. She's laid down with me before at a football game. She was faking sick. What? What? <laughs> What I, swear. Do you do? <laughs> I swear I'm not wait, kidding. Wait, hold on. It was my first Molly year. Molly Ann. Is that true? Yes, it's true. She faked that she was sick. She laid down on the she ground. She laid down in the end zone and everyone thought she was dying. <laughs> <laughs> what, she was just sick of running up and down? I guess. I don't know. All right, I don't I, know. I, I've, was... I've, I've looked up mules Wait, and their do? speed. Wait, what do you do when you when the, when when Molly Ann lays down in the end zone and the and the fans <laughs> think she's dying? <laughs> But she's really just faking sick. What do you do? Well, I just got her up, and we just took her back to the arena for the How do you get her up? She was just, <laughs> I don't know. We just pulled like, her up. Like, grab her by her ear? <laughs> yes. Come on, my you man. forklift? Oh, like, already. Fork- Prop her up? I mean, I would think if you're a 1,000 pounds, you could kind of do whatever you want, right? But Yeah, she did whatever she wanted that day. Okay, and then so when, you're, when the team would score... She was just well, laying there? She was doing good, like, the first few quarters. And then I think it was, like, around the third quarter, um, she just, like, laid down and wouldn't do anything. Like, was laying down, flat down. Yeah. And didn't move for a while. And was the defense playing and he badly? Wasn't there. Did, I guess. I did, don't know. Did she have money on the game? <laughs> yes, she did. <laughs> and were you losing? I don't remember. Oh. I mean, if you're losing, that would be the 
obviously perfect. Maybe she maybe she knew. I don't know. Do you think she likes football? I think she does. She you definitely do. knows when to run. I, I promise you. When the ca- crowd goes crazy, she just kind of takes off on her own. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. You don't even have to coach her up. Okay, well, well, none of you people over there go crazy, all right? Yeah, right. Yeah, <laughs> none of y'all start going crazy over <laughs> hey, there. So, Rosa, what did you find out about speed? Uh, the, the, the biggest mule, which, which Molly Ann is, uh, yeah. they are about eight seconds slower than the top thoroughbred horses. Oh. Yeah, they're about eight seconds slower. <laughs> eight seconds slower? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then the top thoroughbred? Yeah, so Black Ruby, who's like a famous mule, ran the half mile, did the half mile in like 53 seconds, which was, uh, that's eight seconds slower than the top thoroughbred. Oh, wow. I mean, they're so not. So she can dart. Yeah, she goes Yeah, she's fast. fast. That's fast. Does it's be, still fast. Does being the mascot at Southern Arkansas take up the majority of your life? Uh, really in the fall, basically, yeah. Because I've got football games, football games, and then we'll have to go to Walmart and do some stuff. I'm actually going to a news station pretty soon in October. And then home games. What do you do at Walmart? <laughs> <laughs> we gotta go shop. to Walmart. I take her in and shop. No, yeah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I mean, if, the, if you go, I've never been, been to Southern Arkansas. I mean, I, I, like I a, don't know. I think it's a probably allowed in the Walmart in West Memphis. I think you could get we away with it. Take her to it. the self checkout. No, yeah. I'm just kidding. We don't. I, look, I, 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 I don't want. I don't want to come off rude. But the idea that you had literally no reservations about bringing the mule into the studio <laughs> leaves to me nothing off the table. If you, if it's Southern Arkansas, they walk through, like if, if it walks in Walmart, like, I don't know. You yeah. didn't think it was weird? What, walking you were, in here? Yeah, you were just like, yeah, we'll figure it out. Yeah. And that's what I kept. That's how both True to your word. You're the best, Abby, because <laughs> true to your word, I kept telling my bosses, she said it's fine. I think so. I put all my trust. We've never met before, but I put all your. Oh, and I'll be damned if there is not a mule a foot away from me. I I think we need to take her to the the Las Vegas Strip, maybe Rodeo Drive and in, oh. in Beverly Hills, yes. maybe Wall Street in New York. Let's just no back to Walmart. Is it like an appearance? Yeah, they do. Um, they'll do like cookouts and fundraisers there, and they just get me there for you know to take pictures for the little kids. And I mean, people shop in SAU students are always in the Magnolia Walmart. So Magnolia, what is in Magnolia? If I go to Magnolia, Flying Burger. What? <laughs> Flying Burger. Yeah, it's what's a, that? It's a hamburger joint that's amazing. It's my favorite burger place ever. Really? Really? It's like seafood and hamburgers. Seafood and hamburgers. Mm-hmm. Shrimp, grilled fish, catfish, chicken strips. Flying burger. Flying burger. The burger flies. <laughs> and if you want to go have, like, fun, if you're going to go to Magnolia and, like, go out, yeah. where do the college kids go out besides uh, Flying Burger? Well, we have two joints, really. It's called Corner Clubhouse. That's, like, where um, you can go watch games and stuff. It's kind of like the sports place people go to. All right. And then a new place that just opened is Mule Kick. And um, it actually <laughs> <laughs> Mule Kick. their logo is, like, kicking it. Get it? Yeah. <laughs> and so, um, anyways, it's literally, it's not even a mile uh, from the school. And you can go there. They actually just opened in June. And they've been doing, like, trivia nights, like Jenga trivia and stuff like that. So, I'm trying to convince them to do karaoke one day. So, so th- how many kids go to school there? Uh, I think roughly around four to 5,000. SAU as a whole? Yeah. Yeah. Four to 5,000? Mm-hmm. So, do you know most of I mean, you? know what I mean? Everybody kind of knows everybody at the school? Yeah, kind of, sort of. I mean, yes. I can be walking from... Chick Fil A to the business building, and I'll run into somebody I know. Um, so yeah. Is Magnolia really small? Like, is that the big thing in the city? Yeah. Like the mm-hmm. the school is. Yeah. The city. Yeah. Like for the most part, right? Mm-hmm. So if school is out. Magnolia is dead. I mean, no, I'm saying I, like, I, went, to a, yeah. I went to a small town yeah, school. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. So yeah. like it, when when the college kids aren't in the town, it mm-hmm. feels like nobody's yeah, it in feels the town. like empty. I worked this summer um, yep. as a freshman orientation leader. And, you know, everyone goes home for the summer, and it is, it is, it's dead. Yeah. It is. And then everyone moves back, and it's just like, yay. Right. Yeah. So now what? Like, what what do you parlay being the mascot at SAU into? Like, what are you going to school for? Um, So I'm an ag business major, uh, and I'll finish in May. Is that farming? (laughs) (laughs) I always tell people this is an inside joke, that I'm just going to sell chicken nuggets one day. All right. (laughs) (laughs) So I could go work for Farm Credit, Farm Bureau, Tyson, Pilgrim's. Um, but I haven't decided yet if I want to stay there and get my master's and like be a graduate assistant to help get my master's paid for at SIU. Okay. Um, or just go straight to work. Okay. I have to figure that out very soon. Okay. But when you, when you signed up and you wanted to be an ag major, yeah. right? Well, I was actually an animal science major, but I changed. Okay. And you wanted to do what? 
Like, what, you know what I mean? People pick their majors. Oh. People are thinking, I want to. <laughs> I wanted to be an equine vet, but What's that, that was like my thing. You, a vet for? A vet, like a big vet. For horses? For horses. Equine, yeah. And now, no. No, now, no. Why? After Molly Ann? Well. <laughs> Did she scare no, you off of I, I Well, I changed it, like, right after I got this. And I was like, I'm just going to do ag business. A bunch of my friends are doing ag business. We can help each other. So that's right. what I want with, and I love it. I haven't changed it since. So you, you end up, for the most part, the majority of those it was, people, I've been kids ag- in that major, they work for big food companies. Yes, yes. Yes. I have and, a lot of friends that have moved and done well and have stayed at the school and gotten their master's with an ag business degree. So. Oh, mm-hmm. so, all right. What year are you? Uh, I'm a senior. This is it. This is it. This is it. You and Molly Ann. This is it. Oh, no. So I know. now it, there is a freshman on campus now. That's going to be the new Abby? Mm-hmm. We hate her. <laughs> <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> no, like, I know. Like, are they already trying out? Uh, he'll put out applications in January, so probably after spring break, April-ish, around there. And then, yep, that'll be it. Do you know? Do you know the girl that mm-hmm. already? She's yeah. probably talking behind your back probably. right now. <laughs> she's around campus, and yeah. she's saying, I'm going to be that. I'm gonna be Abby, and I'm gonna be I'm gonna be the mascot, right? Probably. She thinks you're washed up. I'm now. I'm, 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 I'm causing problems no, you're on fine, the SAU you're campus. <laughs> no, but like, there, no guy's ever done it, right? Not that I know of. It's always a girl. It's, it's been a girl. Do you? Is there a, like a, a fraternity, a sorority, as it were, mm-hmm. of the mat? Do you know? The other uh, girls that have been mascots prior uh, to? One girl, she, the girl before me, like what sorority was she in? No, 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 no. I'm saying you know them. Oh, do I know them? Yeah, yes, yeah, Yes, yes, yes. So the girl. So how far does it go back? Do you guys have like a, a do connection. they have like a reunion and they come back? <laughs> <laughs> Some of them come to the uh, homecoming games, which is like when a, a lot of alumni come right? in. Um, and one actually still works for the university. She works over like the alumni. And then and the girl before me is a nurse now. So she's from Falk, Arkansas. Oh, so you know them. Mm-hmm. You know who they are. Mm-hmm. Okay. We're friends on Facebook and stuff. So Really? Yeah, for real. <laughs> Everybody, <laughs> the mascot ends up becoming friends. <laughs> and so they now, uh, they're, one's a nurse. What did you say the other one? One's one a nurse and one works at SAU. She's over like the alumni. She's like an alumni coordinator almost. So you might be done with animals after this though. Maybe. Like, this isn't a career. You don't want to just ride. I wish I could do it forever. Lifetime? Lifetime. Yeah, they only let you do it for three years. Mm. How long has Molly Ann been the mascot? Uh, They got her when she was four, and she's 10 now. So, that long. She's 10 years old. She's 10 years old. You don't look a day over seven. She, uh. (laughs) What? (laughs) <laughs> she probably won't you, don't think I, you don't think I know uh, donkey you, age? You, I mean, you can just tell mule age? Huh? You can just tell yeah, me. unbelievable genes. By the way, they are stronger than horses. They're stronger? They're stronger than She's horses. Getting, uh, I mean, she is really <laughs> sniffing my hand. I look Every time up. I move my hand, is there something with my hand? She probably thinks you have a treat. Oh. Do I have a treat? I don't have a treat. Give me a treat. <laughs> it, is she going to bite my hand? I don't know. She won't. Just hold it What flat. do you mean? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> just don't the mule your has greater strength no, for its size it. and just more endurance. Like she said, I said, will she bite my ass? She goes, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> will she bite it? No. You promise me. Promise. All right. Ru- Rusty hold, hold feeding a mule. I got a lawyer, Rusty. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> Scare me to death. All right. I'm sorry. Ah. You can have it. Ah. <laughs> I dropped two of them. <laughs> Well, you, are you going to get it? Oh, you dropped it again. Molly Ann, now you're showing your age. Ten-year-old. <laughs> Ten-year-old. Dude, what am I, Spilling what stuff am I gonna everywhere. Do it's gonna, it, look, she's going to try to get down on my book bag. And yes, she is. One. In a second. Oh, boy. Here we go. All right. Molly Ann, is, how long do they get to be the mascot? Just until it's ready for her to retire. I mean, they get pretty old, uh, 22, 23 area. Oh. So, yeah. She'll, oh. Yeah. I didn't realize that. 22, 23? Mm-hmm. Does, Molly, uh, does Molly Ann have a boyfriend? Not that I know of. No? No? She's no. just there by herself. She's in there day. with horses, but. Oh, she is. They don't, they don't mess with They yeah. cannot reproduce? She just huh? kind of does not reproduce. Bank. Mules can't reproduce? What it says. No, they can't. Yeah, they cannot reproduce. Oh, is that right? Mm-hmm. So yeah. they're, well, I mean, I was, the reason I was asking is this a legacy question. You know what I mean? Is there going to be a, 
like a, you know, a Molly Ann, I guess, what, what, are, what do they call a baby <laughs> mule? Do you know? Uh, what do they call it? Do you guys know? What do they call a, a baby, baby mule? mule? They call it a baby mule? A baby Molly. <laughs> a baby, right, but there's no such thing. The you females can't have, are Mollies. The females are all Mollies? Every female mule is named Molly. Well, not named, but they're a Molly mule. Oh, and then what are the males called? They're jacks. Jacks. Of course. <laughs> of course. I knew that. Everybody knows that. What, Rosa, what'd you find? Nothing? No, no, it says, I mean, it says Colt and Philly is what you call them. I, I, but That'll be the, I, I mean, that's like a horse. Right, that's what I thought, yeah, that's what yeah. I thought horses, yeah. Oh, my goodness. All right. So Wikipedia is wrong. Is the football team at Southern Arkansas supposed to be good this year? They're pretty good. And you guys have, what's the first game? September 14th. Which is against, do we know? I'm not sure. Who is it, no, Roser? Just... Look up that schedule. You guys got o- some. Hey, it's Oklahoma Baptist. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys have unbelievable mascots throughout your whole conference, mm-hmm. right? We do. Who are the other? Like, there's a... We have the Bull Weevils. The Bull Weevils, I think yes. it's a, I don't know, a bug. Yeah. <laughs> a cotton weevil I don't know <laughs> what do your parents think of this by the way they love do they it. love it yeah they do they do mm-hmm. do you have brothers and sisters I have a sister mm-hmm. she is uh, younger younger why is she not the next I don't know I've got to convince her to come to SA she's only 15 okay so she still has she's a sophomore in high school maybe so so but you this will be is this year number three for you yes Oh, my goodness. Yep. Three years, Roser. Three years. Three years. Abby and Molly Ann together. <laughs> and this is the swan song year. I hope they win the national title. I <laughs> will remember you. Yeah, that, I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't feel like this, this is now. I mean, this, she is so well behaved. <laughs> I have, like, for somewhere along... Somewhere throughout this entire conversation, it became non-weird to me that there's a thousand-pound animal of food for me. <laughs> I don't know at what point, but now it feels natural because this is easily the best-behaved animal I've ever been around in my entire life. <laughs> Look, she's looking right at me. Yes, she is. All right. The rest of her day is what? She now, I guess, I mean, obviously you guys have to go back to Magnolia, Arkansas, mm-hmm. but she'll then just go to the, she'll just go she'll to, go to the field mm-hmm. and is she just now until game day? Yeah, well, well. And appearances, that's it? Mm-hmm. She'll get brought up uh, before game day and other appearances we have to go to and just, she gets her a little haircut and a bath and fed and yeah, she'll be up with a fan in her little stall. Now, do they supply you with the hat, or do you mm-hmm. get to pick your own hat? Well, I got to pick it all. <laughs> but you picked all of it? Mm-hmm. The school, like, provides the funds for it. So, And then the saddle was made. I don't know if you looked at the saddle, but it says, like, SAU on it. Oh. And the saddle was made long before my time. This is unbelievable. Southern Arkansas. Magnolia, <laughs> Arkansas, yeah. Roser. Magnolia, Arkansas. That's where they are. Shout out to Magnolia, Arkansas. <laughs> The Did mule you think riders. it was goofy when you first heard that they were the mule riders? Mm-mm. No. No. You thought that was... I mean, I was just you like... You thought that was totally normal. Yeah. That's how this all happened. Is yeah. Because when I said it, I'm like, there's no way. I there's no one else has that name, right? No, no one uh-uh. ever. Is it just... Are there people that ride mules in southern Arkansas outside of you? No. Not that I know of. I mean, and they I, did once upon a time, thus the name, yes, right? Yes, yes. It was a big, everybody in the city rode mules. Yes. Probably. Probably. Is that right? Probably. That's how they got, <laughs> that's that's how that's they got to and from. <laughs> in Magnolia. Yeah. Have you ever ridden her anywhere that was not an event? Mm, I've ridden her at the arena. Like, did you, uh, do you ride, could you ride her to, like, Flying Burger? I probably could. I think it'd be fun. And nobody, would, it would be fine? I, no, everyone would just be taking pictures and probably laughing. Like, for real, people just be taking pictures and stopping me. It's the swan song year. That's what I want to <laughs> see. Swan song. I want to see it. You only got one last chance. I know, I know. With Molly Ann, right? I know. And so you've got to make the most of it. Mm-hmm. I want a trip. That's with why I'm you here. and Molly Ann. Yeah, no, you've made it all the way here, for goodness <laughs> sake. And you and Molly Ann go to Flying Burger. That's what you guys do. You should come to Magnolia. Well, how do we get there? Uh... <laughs> How far away is it? You said it took you four and a half? Four and a half, yeah. Are your games Friday night? Saturday. They're on All Saturday. Saturdays? I mean, it'd have to be in September prior to the Grizzly season starting. 
Have you ever been to Memphis before? I have in high school. What for? Uh, we came to the St. Jude Hospital. We took like a trip and we got to go to the Peabody and stuff and went down like Bill Street and stuff like that. Oh, mm-hmm. that's unbelievable. With your high school? Yes. From Shreveport? Uh, Minden, Louisiana. Mind- Minden, Louisiana. Yes. Have you ever been here, Rusty? Yes. You have? Many t- Oh, he said I mean, many times. <laughs> many times. He's been, to, he's, been to, he's been to Memphis many times. Have you guys ever been to a Grizzly game? I haven't. We're getting her to a Grizzly yeah, game. Yeah, we're going to get to a Grizzlies game. game. Yeah. We're, yes. I don't know if we can get Molly Ann in. <laughs> she just licked the, the table. <laughs> she did. <laughs> you want that treat, don't you? Hold on. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> All right. Hold on. Here, what if I put it on the table? Then can you get it? Sure. Oh, look. Oh. Oh, shoot. <laughs> can she not see it? Oh, her eyes are kind of on the side of her head, right? <laughs> so she's got, like, unbelievable peripheral vision, but not necessarily straight ahead, right? Have you had a boyfriend while you've been at school? Uh, I actually do now. How yes. jealous is he of, of Molly Ann <laughs> and, the, and, the, and this whole and this whole operation, right? Because your time, it's you and the. Does he ever say, "Oh, that horse"? No. <laughs> You're with no. the horse all the time. <laughs> he you know doesn't. I mean? No. He doesn't. He loves it. Yes, he does. He does. He does. Did he did he start hitting on you when you were? <laughs> Like when you were the mascot? No. Is that how you guys met each other? No. I actually told him happy birthday, and we were just kind of friends, you know, and our friends were like, y'all should hang out. And I was like, no, you know, I don't really want a boyfriend right now. This was, this just happened, like, probably like a year ago. Um, And then we finally, like, started dating the spring of last semester. Well, congratulations to you. Did you ever get the guy saying, hey... (laughs) You're the girl on the horse. Sometimes, right? yeah. Yes? Yes, sometimes, yes. I can, I can only imagine, right? Yeah. Like, you got center stage in southern Arkansas, mm-hmm. right? right. You're, you're riding around on the horse, and they're like, who's she? Right? Yes. <laughs> it's probably a pretty good gig at Magnolia, mm-hmm. I would imagine, right? Do they have, like, a do they have like a cheerleading squad? Yes. Does, do they hate you? No. Oh, I'm they don't. The cheerleader. <laughs> Cersei and everybody paying attention to, my, uh, to Abby riding the horse. Well, we don't call tailgating the mule. SAU. I'm sorry, the we mule call riders. It mule gating. Oh, you call it mule gating. Mule gating. Mm-hmm. So I'm there for like the tailgates. You know when they do like the pep rally and stuff before the uh, football team and the band walks over. Yep. And the cheerleaders are there, and I like sit there with them with the mule while they do their little thing. Their little th- oh, oh. Their so little maybe thing. it's you that resent no, them and and my little, their little thing, and then I steal the show. Was well, me and Molly Ann because once 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 you guys roll up, it's over. No, <laughs> you're right. <laughs> so They're like, okay, we're everyone's done. out there mule gating. Have you ever done an interview sitting on a mule? Not on the mule. Usually sitting in the chair with outer. <laughs> <laughs> it's usually just me. <laughs> Has this been wildly uncomfortable, or is this okay? No, it's fine. I mean, we said go big or go I home. I did it. I did it. <laughs> I did it. Look at that. You ever seen anybody do this? No. Name another podcast in America. <laughs> <laughs> Name another one in America that has a thousand-pound animal in, in the studio. studio. And it was fine in the elevator. Yeah. Devin, Unbelievable. He rode with he rode with her. Devin. You he was with <laughs> Devin and Molly Ann <laughs> rode up in the elevator. <laughs> <laughs> Which if I could if if there is a video of that. Oh, let me tell you when the when the elevator door opened. Devin was the first one off that thing. <laughs> <laughs> he was the first one. He was he was like <laughs> Unbelievable. Incredible. You guys are the best. We will be Southern Arkansas fans Forever. for life to the end of time. We're mule riders for yeah, life. Yeah, absolutely. What is, saddle up, right? Sa- saddle up. They always say, "Tonight we ride." Tonight we ride. <laughs> Tonight <laughs> we ride. Hashtag saddle up. <laughs> and we and I'm gonna do my best to drag these guys. We'll try to get down there. Yeah. For, yeah. We'll, we'll try to find one of those Saturday games because. That, do they have hotels? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey man. Yes. Where are we? Where are we hey, no, no, no. They have. A, where is it? Here it is. Magnolia is home to the Magnolia Blossom Festival and World Championship State Cook-Off. Yes, they're good. That Let's att- go. That attracts over 40,000 people. What? So you better have hotels if you're getting 40,000 people. When, is, they, when is the State Cook-Off? Uh, it doesn't say. Oh, it's but the food, the, Oh, the Food Network's there, too. They usually go to it. The yeah. Food Network. Yeah. All right. Well, we could go to, well, look, we got to go to Flying Burger and get some burgers and seafood. <laughs> 
Magnolia is which locally is, known. Which is not a very common it's duo, good. would you say? I know. You say it's good. I, I promise. It's there's not a lot of life. restaurants, though, that you'd say. they got. It's a burger place with seafood. <laughs> Magnolia <laughs> is known for their downtown shopping on the square and for their murals, one of which is signed by Charlton Heston. Really? Yeah. You ever seen that? The mural? Mm-hmm. What is it? What's the mural of? I think it's, if it's the one he's talking about. It's the one with, like, cotton on it. It's on the side of, like, Corner Clubhouse. Huh. Um, it has, That's like, the it place has where we got to go to the sports bar. Yeah. And then we go mule gating. Yep. And then we go to yeah. a football game. Yep. And then <laughs> well, we stop by we stop by Southland and we and we bet on the game first. And then <laughs> I don't think, <laughs> I, they, 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 I doubt they have lines on it. I don't yeah. think they have lines I don't on think it. Have lines if they on do, it. we will though. Oh yeah. And then um, what is it? If if I really do show up, could I ride it after a touchdown? After a touch, like yeah. in the game? Yeah, Dude, with you, the flag. No, you don't want to oh, do that. You'd fall off. No, that would be a mistake. You'd, you'd fall <laughs> off. No, no, we you don't, don't have insurance do for that. <laughs> you don't want to do that. We don't have insurance yeah. for that. I, I do like how you are in more of an upright position yeah. now. You really are. You, how about if I dressed Rosa up like a donkey <laughs> <laughs> and, and yes. I see him run with the flag? Would, would, would the fans be upset no, if I, they weren't getting the real thing please. and he was... Running across. I ain't trying to run. <laughs> trying to run. The I'll, walk, I'll walk across the end zone. <laughs> I'm running. All right. If I pet her, is she going to lose her mind? No. You promise? I promise. She just put her ears You're too fast. Too she fast. Just She's going to be <laughs> slow. Just slow. Gentle. <laughs> she She's away. not going to lose her mind. Look, look. Just oh, on her nose. Uh, the, oh, she likes the nose. Her eyes got real big. I think she likes to get her nose rubbed. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> you guys are the best. Abby, Molly Ann, Southern Arkansas, we love you at the Chris Vernon Show. Yes. This is honestly forever. Yes. I, I don't think I can top this. Hey, Chris, I didn't think that you were going to message me. I was like, this guy has a check by his name on Twitter. I said, I don't think he's about this. I really didn't oh. think you were going to message me. Not only was he about what this. I'm our, serious. Our boss was about this. The, I, I believe the text was, you're getting the mule in studio. <laughs> <laughs> you are getting that mule here. Okay. I'm going to tell you, until here. you walked through that door, I did not think it was happening. Really? Yeah, I thought something would happen, like it would get stopped and – Maybe, it just wouldn't be able to make it up here. Wouldn't no, be able to get I the elevator. That, I thought that at some point, somebody would have the wisdom to say, this is, <laughs> <laughs> this is insane. No. Like, this, this is ridiculous. And it would probably be the moment that the 1,000-pound mule is standing outside our door <laughs> or about to get on our work elevator. By the way, for everybody out there, we are on the fourth floor. <laughs> you can see the back floor. Yeah, right. This is this is the top floor. This is the top floor. <laughs> and if the elevator stops, God, tell me the elevator stopped. It didn't. If it would have stopped on the way up, <laughs> that uh, would have been the most amazing. Devin would have been probably the most claustrophobic person in the world no, if that, that would have no, happened. If there was somebody that had pressed the button, then they were trying to go somewhere. <laughs> Was there and anybody the door open and there was the mule? No, no, which did, did, y'all, did y'all come that? in on the very bottom? Did they <laughs> come in on the very bottom that? floor? Was there anybody like in the lobby? Like uh, anybody in a suit, like just waiting yeah. for to meet I was someone here? There's gonna be like somebody at a very important somebody meeting. Somebody important, no. Yeah, very important meeting. There was a few people sitting at like the front desk, but I didn't see nobody came up or anything. Well, maybe on the way down. Well, I've already got my mule rider shirts and I'm gonna be repping. Okay. And now we're going to take you guys over there, and we're going to make sure we get you set up so that when you guys go back to Magnolia, you're wearing grizzly stuff everywhere. Okay. That's what we got to have happen. Uh-huh. You guys are the best. Thank you guys. No problem. So much. It's going to do it for us today. This happened. This happened. Yep. Look, there's a girl sitting on a thousand pound <laughs> mule in the studio. <laughs> <laughs> Molly Ann. Abby and Molly Ann from Southern Arkansas University. Thank you to John Rosa across the glass. Oh, oh, uh, is Kimball who runs? Hey, Kim, Kim the, is she you losing have her no mind? idea how stressed out she was. The cameras are not where they normally are. We had to move them all around, so she has been stressed all day. Kimball, awesome job. Uh, the odds couple dropping at two o'clock today. Benny Verno makes an appearance. Benny Verno makes and an he appearance. And has a pick for tonight's game. Johnny the Fish has a pick tonight. What? We're going over in Texas A and M, Texas State. We're going over the fifty-six. Oh, okay. Uh, make sure you watch the odds couple because Vinny Verno did make an yes. a- appearance and pick the game that is going on tonight. Mortal luck.
That's a mule. This is. I feel like I'm gonna wake up. <laughs> like there's no way that this just happened, but this happened. Until tomorrow, we gone.